Well, outraged community activists poured into the streets tonight demanding to put an end to gun violence as another Bronx site was shot and killed earlier this week. News 12 Cecilia Hua has the story from Grand Concourse in Fordham. Dozens of community members gathered on the Grand Concourse, reacting to another act of gun violence in our borough. Every time an incident like this occurs, we, you know, we come out to the community, um, all boots on the ground, reintroduce ourselves. Early Tuesday morning, police found 28-year-old Parrish Truesdale on the Grand Concourse with a gunshot wound in his head. He was pronounced dead at the hospital. We're losing people to senseless gun violence. Bragg or Bronx Rises Against Gun Violence is a community-based program that identifies hotspots and at-risk youths in the city and helps to resolve conflicts in the streets. We basically don't have to tell them who we are because they know who we are. All of our staff come to the communities that we serve. That's what makes them credible in the community. So if they're going to have someone put a weapon down at 2 o'clock in the morning, it has to be someone that they know. Using the Cure Violence model, Bragg offers various programs to these youths to guide them away from violence. We have, you know, Bragg um, boxing program. We have a, a music recording studio with a 12-week curriculum. We have um, Bragg at Vogue, you know, um, learn how to do resumes, job training. We have. Um, Bragg Therapeutics. Bragg has three offices throughout our borough located in Wakefield, Morris Heights and Fordham. Anyone is welcome to go into their offices and ask about their programs. Meanwhile, police are still on the hunt for the individual responsible for Truesdale's death. In Fordham, Cecilia Hua, News 12. Cecilia.